the stay safe world here you already know what's going on man we got to talk about this situation with kid trunks where he was allegedly shot in the face last night in miami florida we gonna get into the details what could have possibly led to everything but before we do i'm gonna need y'all to like comment subscribe and let's run this up so in case you didn't know already the members only member Kid Trunks, XXX Tentacion's like right hand man basically, has been having like a pretty tough fucking past couple months. It, um, if you aren't really following up with him, basically he <clears throat> he got exposed for faking cancer, and I don't know what this is like the whole reason why he got shot in the face. I mean like we can only like wonder what could have led to shoot this man because he's like literally like a five six asian dude i don't really see the threat like yeah he'd be toting guns and shit but i mean i i i do be seeing he'd be having like sometimes like beef with people on the internet and stuff so that could be an issue with it but basically he got exposed for like faking cancer and stuff he like literally said he had cancer then two three weeks later he said that he was completely cured and shit i'm not even sure how the fuck that happens but that's besides the point so his career was already facing like a lot of like downhill trajectory you know over the past couple months and then this is just crazy like this man posted this on his story like his whole chin was basically blown off it's actually a miracle that he's alive right now i'm not sure what exactly happened but apparently his ops caught him i mean like gun violence is a real issue in florida and i wouldn't be surprised if he like just got caught up at the wrong place at the wrong time i mean people could have been aiming for him you know like how they got his brother jaw like he was like riding around with like hella cash and shit i know kid trunks probably doesn't have hella cash so it must have been like some personal shit you know i'm just wondering how the hell does this man always end up in the like the the fuzzy end of the lollipop you know like first the whole cancer situation after he alleged cancer situation after he got an overdose and then now his life is threatened by getting shot in the face man like karma must really not like this guy i don't know if it's karma for like the whole cancer situation or what but whatever the fuck is going down with this man it's not cool like i feel bad for him at a certain point because it's like definitely like the first time around it looked like he was trying to use like the hospital visit as like a way to get clout and go and go fund me and shit and he needed help paying his medical bills i don't know how the hell this man is gonna pay his medical bills now because like he's this is like another at least ten thousand dollars that he's gonna have to pay in medical bills i mean this is just like a signal to yourself that it could always get way worse so you should be happy with what's happening now as long as you're not getting shot in the face and not like almost getting cancer and shit allegedly getting cancer and shit then you're gonna have you're having a good day man like I feel bad for him because it like I, I obviously can't post that shit on YouTube because of the terms and conditions and shit. I'm gonna put in my Patreon the full like examination and everything that he posted from the fucking like uh, hospital or whatever. But it's just like super fuck. Like who and like the only reason why I would imagine because like a lot of the members only people have like individual beefs like you look at like tankhead for instance he was in jail because of something that somebody allegedly stole money from him and then he pulled up and then his friend got shot in the process and then he tried to run his shit and then now he's in jail for probably life or whatever so that's just another example you got x who died and then it's like i just feel like these dudes are just like so used to like running shit in florida I mean, after X died, the whole members only like went tanked, went down in the dumpster, like 100%. They had that project that they dropped where they dropped it under his name and shit. Then after that, it all kind of just fell apart. And the only real relevant people are really just Rob Banks and Ski Mask. I mean, Ski Mask is a whole different group though, very rare, but you get the point. Those are the only people like somewhat relevant. And you could even argue that those two people have fallen off. So. I feel like part of it is just niggas be thinking that like, oh yeah, we run Florida. We can do whatever the fuck we want. You feel me? Like that's how they were when it when X was still alive. And you saw what happened when X did that. It didn't work out like that. So, you know, like everyone has a gun in Florida. There's no real like like 
the rules are very lenient to guns and he literally says that people need to put the guns down and shit like honestly i'm interested in seeing more details of what exactly happened like was it on purpose or was it an accident i don't know man like part of me is thinking like it could have honestly been an accident because i mean if he really has static like that i guess people could have tried to shoot him but i mean like the way that it was angled it does look like it hit like the bottom of his chin and then kept going that way but i know for certain that these dudes be walking around with hella guns like be walking around with pistols out and shit like no license for that bitch no concealed carry permit and be high as fuck just doing whatever so i wouldn't even be surprised if it was a self-inflicted gun wound bro like i wouldn't be surprised because niggas be playing with guns way too much in videos and shit it's not the first time we've seen that we've seen like rappers accidentally shoot cameraman accidentally like lil wayne accidentally shot himself bro like i wouldn't be surprised if it was self-inflicted or something like that like honestly at this point i hope that's not the case it could have been some beef shit or something. When we get more details on the situation, I'm going to keep y'all updated. But real stay safe shit. You already know what's going on. Make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe and shit. Let me know your opinion. What you think happened? You think he, one of the ops caught him? Or you think it was some self-inflicted, like, accidental shit? Or one of his homies accidentally shot him or some shit? I don't know. Real stay safe shit. You already know. Peace.